Hi, my name is Dr. Robert Soto. Today I'm going to talk about porcelain veneers and give some reasons why someone may want to have porcelain veneers. This is a case of 12 porcelain veneers. This is before they're bonded onto the teeth and uh, each individual veneer is an uh, individual piece of porcelain that is painstakingly crafted to enhance the color, the shape, and the position of a tooth. So the veneers are very small. It's about the size of a contact lens and ideally they are bonded to the front surface of a, of a tooth. And so uh, one common reason that someone may want to have veneers is because the edges of the teeth are broken. So these edges are broken and the teeth are shorter because of it. So with veneers we're able to bring back the proper length and the proper shape uh, and symmetry of these teeth. This is another case where the, where the teeth are broken. Um, the edges are, are broken here. The color is also uh, darker, so we're able to whiten the teeth, uh, so the back teeth and the front teeth will match, and we would put four veneers on the upper, four veneers on the lower, and we corrected the gum shape. So you can see there's a nice curve to the gum tissue, which, uh, which wasn't there before. There's a little too much gum tissue here. The position of teeth can be changed. This individual has um, her lower teeth, some of the lower teeth in front of the, of the upper teeth and uh, the upper teeth should be in front of the lower teeth. So this, la this central incisor, this lateral incisor, and this canine here um, were all repositioned through, the, through the, uh, the fabrication of the veneers. This uh, person was also missing their canines uh, on, the, on the top. So there's no canine here, no canine here, but with veneers I was able to uh, shape the premolar veneers to look as if they are canines. So now when you look down here, she has a full set of teeth, um, or it looks as if she has a full set of teeth, and they are in the proper position. <clears throat> Uniformity is important. Uh, over time, we have uh, different types of dental work done. We have four crowns here, or, or three crowns of one type, another crown of a different type, another crown over here, third type of material some filling material over here. So uh, this individual wanted to have uh, a nice uniform set of teeth, so we did 10 veneers, and um, in addition to making everything symmetrical and um, enhance the, the appearance, we were still able to, to um, whiten the teeth and to correct the gum, uh, gum tissue and the length. This person uh, has suffers from bruxism. That's when you grind your teeth um, and clench your teeth habitually. Uh, over time, we're going to see that the teeth shorten quite a bit and the edges uh, are often very rough or misshapen. So um, this individual did have a full rehabilitation, meaning uh, porcelain crowns on all the upper teeth, porcelain crowns on all the lower teeth. Uh, and one of the features, or one of the, the effects that we get uh, with the full mouth rehabilitation is is that we actually lengthen the face overall so when someone grinds their teeth for many many years their entire face will be shorter and by heightening the by lengthening the teeth we, uh, we also lengthen the face and it's a much more youthful appearance than having the shorter face this individual had six veneers done on her front six teeth uh, and one of the problems with having six veneers as opposed to eight, ten, or even just four is that when we make the canines the proper shape, often we will, oftentimes we'll block out the back teeth so that uh, when she smiles, you cannot see the back teeth at all and it looks as if she's missing her back teeth. So by uh, reshaping the gum tissue and uh, adding 12 veneers to the top teeth, we're able to uh, lengthen the teeth so you see less gum tissue. We're able to give her a more full smile uh, so when she smiles you can see those back teeth. So again my name is Dr. Robert Soto. I practice in San Francisco and um, you can give us a call at the office 415-398-8555 or you can uh, visit our website sfveneer.com. I encourage you to look at sfveneer.com. It's a great site uh, where you can learn uh, quite a bit about uh, veneers and, and other aspects of co cosmetic dentistry. There's lots of before and after photos. There's frequently asked questions about veneers. Um, and then you can always come in for a consultation if you just give us a call or email at us. Email us at info at sfveneer.com. Thank you very much.